Hey everyone, so I am here um, with Patricio and Logan and we have just done our Christmas tree shopping. Um, so in Vegas, I don't know if you guys have the this company too, but we have Rudolph Christmas trees. Um, they have tons of lots all around the town. Um, so we, a lot of the times we go here or to Star Nursery. We tried Star Nursery first, but um, we didn't really like any of their options. Um, so we came here and yeah, we picked out our tree. They are going to put it on top of our car for us. Um, and then we will be heading down to our house to set it up. Peep my Christmas earrings, they jingle. Look how cute this is. They do a fresh cut on the Christmas tree for you and then they gave it to us so we can make a cute little ornament out of it. So we'll probably write our names or maybe the animals names on it um, and hang this as an ornament. Starting off by putting in the Christmas lights. Um, we went with white lights this year. I tend to do that the um, in recent years. I know when I was younger, I used to really love the multicolored lights, and now uh, the older I get, the more I really just like the classic white warm lights. I think it's just such a nice classy look and um, I ended up using three strings of these white lights. Um, they're just your standard lights, probably from Home Depot. I've had these for a couple of years. But um, yeah, we used three strands and just went all throughout the middle. really nice to have tall people to help do this because our tree is quite tall this year um, it's a little over nine foot so uh, yeah it is very tall and I cannot reach the top of this tree without a ladder which you will see me utilize a little bit later on in the video So I decided to switch it up this year and actually do a theme for the Christmas tree. I mean, I always I always get like the pack of multicolored bulbs um, or ornaments for the tree, but I really wanted to go kind of with the all blue and silver look. That way it would match our ocean theme that we have throughout the rest of our house. So I really loved these bulbs. Um, sorry, do you guys call them bulbs or do you call them ornaments? I kind of use them interchangeably. But um, yeah, I just really love these ornaments and I really think that the color just matches the rest of our house so perfectly. Um, the blue is kind of like the exact same shade as the ocean pictures that are behind the tree. So I really just love it. And then of course we did still end up hanging some of our favorite um, of the like random ornaments. Like we have some handmade ones and um, ones that have been gifted to us. So we did end up still hanging those. But the rest we went with the blue and white theme. 
let me know what you guys think and also let me know down in the comments do you guys do themed trees or themed ornaments or do you just do all random ornaments let me know for the tree topper we do use a star this is a new star and I think it's really cute um, it's kind of rustic wood look um, which I think is adorable let me know do you guys use a star or an angel as your tree topper finishing touch I am using this new garland that I just got from Target again it's the white and blue to match the theme um, I think it's really pretty I love use using garland I know not everybody does garland but I just always love to add just a little bit of it because I think it just adds a really pretty touch and also adds just more like texture to the tree so highly recommend if you've never used garland on your tree before maybe give it a try one year and just sort of see how you like it I only used two strands of garland this year because I didn't want it to be too overwhelming but I think it turned out really cute 